Okay, considering all these things, what are the um, what are the actionable things for us for successful implementation of AI? Um, first and foremost, identify the kind of problem that could be solved by AI, which goes back to the first point I was making, right? Not all the problems are um, lend itself well for AI. Just because technology is there doesn't mean it needs to be solved through that particular technology. Then what is the key success metrics for using this technology? What I mean by that is how do we know when we get there that it is successful? Um, second, of whether or not you have a culture to go with it, or whether you have enough business buy-in, whether you have a sponsor who is able to um, work with the technical team to understand um, now it's not a technical product, it's also a business outcome. So we need to have a business context to be provided to the AI problem. Um, third is about data governance. We need to have a, you know, a good quality of data governance to ensure that the data that's been used to, to act as an input, uh, to be used as a prompt, it's a data that is not sensitive or if it is sensitive, that's actually within the guard rails. Um, finally, how do you then operationalize it? Um, how can you make sure that it is going to be running continuously and get the feedback? Um, you know, if, if you are all worried about all those things, if, but the, the quickest way to get our quick bang for the buck is to get the model that comes with the systems, like, you know, say it's for CRM or whatever, um, then all you have to worry about is focus on the outcome. Basically, how do I serve the customer best? How do I sell the um, most effective product or most effective service to the next person on the queue. All, all you have to do is consume the AI rather than building it. Uh, and the Salesforce AI technology enables it. Um, like I said before, through the trusted AI layer and in the human in the um, loop approach.